good morning you guys it is day two tuesday of like the first full week of this whole self yeah self-quarantine social distancing whatever you want to call it it's basically quarantine at this point i mean everything shut down like if you saw my last video um we are in columbus ohio but i believe basically all states are starting to look the same as far as like gyms being canceled or gyms being closed everything being closed they haven't closed retailers yet like haven't forced them to close but so many stores have already closed on their own um at least we have online shopping am i right um i'm still trying to support some businesses thankfully my business is not being impacted negatively other than i can't go to the gym and work out like i'm just having to record all home workouts and i am only able to train one of my in-person clients because the other one long story short one of their family members is in the hospital and just with all the coming back and forth it's like we're not even chancing it even though it's just us in their house because they're leaving the other one i am still able to train um at least for right now we'll see how things progress but chris and i are about to go on a walk I did record a little bit this morning. You guys are about to see that. Um, but yeah, someone responded and said that they wanted to see a full day of life or a full day in the life of my cats. So I'll probably do like a little 60 second clip of what their day looks like because I think that'd be funny. Um, but yeah, I've been trying to be on Instagram a lot and get people's feedback about like if they want me to go live during my workouts, which I think I'm gonna start doing. I just have to figure out a time that's best. I still haven't worked out today, so we're gonna do a hamstring and glute workout at some point. But till then, Chris and I are gonna go on a walk. He just got on his lunch break, so go get our activity levels up, our steps in. How's it going? This is his setup. We had to move that thing over there um, but yeah, you're at least here for a week, right? Probably more. later in the day I finally showered it is 3 50 um, I did a live workout on Instagram which was the first time I've ever done that like I worked out on a live video or live story and it went pretty well I know a lot of you are following it or are going to follow it later today so that's exciting hope you guys enjoy it um, I didn't record the full thing on here I recorded just a little portion I'm gonna have to figure out how I'm gonna go about this, but I went to my dad's or went to meet my dad because he had a package for me And I'm super excited to try this coffee over cardio came out with um, Kiss me. I'm Irish coffee flavor for st. Patrick's Day Irish cream. I think this will be really good. So I'll have that tomorrow morning, but I just had some carrots with um, honey ham <laughs> like deli meat I was wrapping the carrots in that. I know it sounds kind of weird, but it's actually really good. And I'm gonna have a Dan and Light Fit Greek yogurt. They only had the single ones left. All the containers were gone. So I'm trying berries and cream for the first time. And I'm gonna work on my computer, but this day has been very effective or very um, productive, but it's been flying by. So far so good though. How's your day going? It's good. Day two working from home. It's good, it's busy. He's kicking butt. I told him that I was proud of him for doing well, working from home. He was like, did you not think I was going to? I feel like some people have a hard time adjusting. I don't know, I feel like that'd be a hard adjustment, but he's, he's doing good. The berries and cream is very good, but I'm gonna go work on my computer on the home guide that will be launching on April 
third along with a gym guide. I have to figure that out because obviously normally the gym guide is more popular, but now that no one can go to a gym, unless you have one in your home, I the home guide is gonna do much better. So I'm trying to figure out if I'm gonna change anything. But we'll see. Alright, Christmas clocked out. Um, I've been working on my computer. We decided, I say we, and then, well, no, he did. He helped me decide. Instead of the home guide being a four day split, it's now gonna be a five day split. So basically it's the exact home version of the gym version. So they're both five days. Anyway, we're making dinner. We have ground bison, or just bison. Um, we haven't made bison in a while, but this is really, really good. I personally, do you like the flavor? Yeah. I like it a lot. I like it better than ground beef. And then we're making our ranch broccoli, frozen broccoli. So that was something people were asking about like healthy meal ideas for a while <laughs> on like quarantine or whatever. And as I showed you guys before, obviously vegetables go bad pretty quickly. So we stocked up on frozen vegetables. So we're trying to have like a protein source, like some kind of meat, chicken, bison, ground beef, ground turkey, something like that, paired with veggies to keep our carbs a little bit lower because we're definitely snacking a little bit more. Say that's correct? Very yeah. true, yeah. So yeah, trying to keep our main meals lower carb or we have like snacks as far as like fruits, vegetables, like yogurt, carrots, apples. So yeah, I'll show you this once it's done. I want to get like enough close of not of me. <laughs> Ow! Oh my gosh. This is a very like bro Ooh, meal. Ready, ready. Ranch? Southwest Ranch. Were you the one who showed me the video of the person that had like 45 things of um, Thousand Island in their cart? Oh my gosh. <laughs> you have like a hundred bottles of Thousand Island. <laughs> Lele. Is it a little bit of danger that we seek? Walking closer to the edge than we really should. Why do we let our hearts back out there? Time and time again Is it looking for my home and a happy end? And we fight like gladiators Never mind about the failures Fall down and rise again Fall down and rise again And we roll the dice Do you hear her? No. 
She's running around like crazy. I just finished um, going live for the second time for a workout and it went really good. Today was chest and triceps. I'm trying to stick to my normal workout schedule just because I wanna to try to stay on a routine. I think that's something that's gonna be very beneficial during this very, very, very weird time is just trying to stay as consistent as possible, whether that's finding a new routine now that you don't have work or whatever it is, um, but getting a routine that works for you and trying to stick to it. I don't wanna just be bouncing around because I think that leads to, um, <laughs> it can lead to you not sticking to anything oh, just God. because you'll make excuses. So try not to follow a routine. This is not gonna be my best looking omelet. So anyways, workout was good. It was chest and triceps. There was quite a few people in there and everyone said they were enjoying it, who was doing it, so that was good. And um, I did record one set of everything after I got off so I can post it later on Instagram like as a swipe workout. But now I'm having my breakfast basically, my egg white omelet and I'm gonna make a bagel. Great, and we're going over to my client's house tonight. Um, Let's go! He's, he can lift, she has a barbell. Um, I recorded a workout there this morning as well. So I've been very... Did you have plates? Mm-hmm. Let's go. Yeah. And I have a full bag of spinach. So we're gonna add some spinach into this omelet as well. Get our greens in. What you want to please don't be polite cause i like your attitude let's forget about a curfew cause all that is stuck in my head it's me and you hold speed and my heart is racing but i'm not sure i wanna place it cause it only does this with you our bodies meet i can feel the tension move us into the next dimension let's how's your workout it's great he lifted chest and tricep, or did, well yeah, chest and triceps. No, did chest you? and shoulders. I walked on an incline. This is my, one of my clients' home gyms, and she was very sweet and said that we could come work out here whenever we needed to. I did a workout at home today, but he was gonna lift chest, so we came here and I walked on an incline for like 40 minutes. And then while he was finishing, I did a live on Instagram. But we're gonna head home, make some food. I'm hungry, we have ground, beef to make <laughs> someone sent me flowers and i have no idea who they're from oh i knew it i was right Alyssa. to a truly beautiful soul congratulations on all of your success especially balance leader oh that's so sweet the world is desperate for young, strong women who emulate all that you do. Proud to know you. Keep on being the best. Sending all the love and hopes and to hanging out someday, Alyssa. I love her. She's so sweet. Look at what. We'll make it happen. Yeah. That's pretty flowers. Ooh, really nice. Now, hold on, let me open these all the way. I got her flowers three times one week and. <laughs> She didn't want any more from me, so I'm glad that it came week. from someone else. <laughs> you guys, we literally, we had two vases full. We had like a reject one, and then we, and then the reject one ended up looking just as good as the main one because we got so many flowers. Oh, these are pretty. Thank you so much, Alyssa, if you're watching this. I think you watch my videos. I freaking love you. These are so pretty. Like, how thoughtful. Who does that? She does. This is the second time. She sent me flowers on our wedding week. Look at those. Obviously, I'm going to fan them out. Do these Beautiful. not look like asparagus? They do look like asparagus <laughs> a little bit. Thank you so much. Oh, we're going to make some din din now. She's the freaking sweetest. I love her. Are you still going? Yeah. All right, bye. someone like you. You. I would watch the days go by, wasted in blue. I was out of use. Now every day, every night, every moment with you, I'm walking on air. And every day, every way, I feel I can't lose.
fine. I finally showered. Um, <laughs> I literally did not shower today until 9 p.m. Um, I got the home guide done and sent off. I have the gym guide done. The only thing I have to do is link a few other videos and then that is sent off. And then surprise, surprise, there's going to be a recipe book. Um, basically just like our recent favorites. Um, the, not necessarily like recipes that we came up with, just like our current favorite recipes right now that we've been making. Um, that will be Still trying to figure out all the details, so I don't want to say too much and then have to like go back on my word. But regardless, those are the three things we've been working on. So I obviously went from working on one guide, which was a lot, to three different things. That's why I've been so busy. It's been insane. And then with the whole coronavirus situation, um, I had to redo the home guide like I was telling you guys. So that's a five day split now. As of right now, the goal is to have the home guide launch as soon as possible just because obviously so many people are not in need of mine specifically, but they're, there's a high demand for home workouts right now because everyone's stuck at home. So I want to get that out as soon as possible. I'm not 100% sure when I'm going to have the challenge start. It was supposed to start on, everything was supposed to launch and start challenge wise um for the 12 weeks on april 3rd so it would have gone through june 28th that's two weeks from the day you're seeing this so the home guide is most likely going to launch early next week it will launch early next week so i'm thinking maybe i have to check with the guy who does my ebooks to make sure this is possible um Say the home guide launches on Monday the 23rd or Tuesday the 24th, as in a few days from when you guys are watching this video. Um, I'm wondering if we can just have the challenge portion start on Monday, March 30th, rather than Friday, April 3rd. Like Monday of two weeks from now, rather than Friday two weeks from now. Um, so once again, that's like, that's what I'm thinking in my head right now. I have to call him tomorrow. So either way, the home guide will be available prior to when the actual challenge starts simply because I know you guys are in need of it, um, or in need of workouts to do at home, but also to give people time to purchase resistance bands, dumbbells. Um, so you have what you need to do the home guide. I'm super excited. They're both 12 weeks. They progress right to get like they they progress together. So there will be a bundle available for the gym guide and the home guide. So for those of you who are kind of in my situation where it's like you're doing the home workouts while this whole weird process is happening with coronavirus. Um, but then as soon as the gyms open up, you'd like to switch to the gym portion this allows you to do that so the guides progress perfectly together obviously the home guide is just dumbbell and resistance bands but gym guide the can't talk the gym guide includes all of the normal gym equipment like my past guides have so this is just not the ideal situation but i honestly in like long term i think this is going to be really cool because I feel like this home guide has the opportunity to help get people through a tough time because I know for most of us, including myself, like the gym is how you, like that's your time for yourself. That's how you relieve stress. That's just your time. And so I know that's a huge thing for people not having that time during the day. And I'm hoping this encourages people to just like stay motivated, keep crushing your new year's resolutions, stick to your routines, stick to those new habits and especially the fact that there's challenges attached to it just like my previous guides i'm just really hoping it encourages people to stick to all their goals like i was saying and also not necessarily getting like i mean yes you want to get in shape for summer but just to be overall healthy for summer so you can go outside enjoy the weather be active like be fit and functional like the guide <laughs> is named um so yeah, I think this is gonna be good. I, I'm really hoping this helps people get through this really odd, not so fun time of being stuck at home. 
at least gives them something to work towards. It gives them a goal. It gives them something to look forward to. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. I will keep you guys updated. The next vlog will have the exact details. So it'll have the exact launch date. It will have when the challenge portion starts. When the, it'll have the pricing, it'll have everything. I will figure out all of the details by the time the next video goes up. Thank you guys for being so patient with me. <laughs> Ugh, these past few days have been so, so, so busy. I'm having fun doing the live workouts though. You guys just saw Chris and I's back workout from today, back and biceps, and it was fun. It was a really good workout, um, and we did go live with that as well. So thank you guys once again for being so uh, patient and understanding through this very weird time. I hope you guys are holding up well at home. And if you have any questions about the home guide or the gym guide or whatever, any questions at all, comment down below. And my goal is to, especially now that I'm basically done writing those guides, I wanna try to get back to daily vlogs. Um, I did get one package of bikinis to do like a bikini haul. I have to get some other ones because right now I'd only have two and that just doesn't make sense. Um, but yeah, I wanna be super frequent on here. And yeah, I need to stop rambling now because this video is gonna be too long. But I love you guys. Thanks for watching the video. If you would um, like the video, subscribe, comment down below. That just sounded so weird. I haven't said that in a long time. Ugh, it's like I forget how to YouTube. I belong, I belong to you. I belong, I belong to you. You do just what you want. I'm